In this video, I'm talking about the Costco Kirkland Signature 9.0 hearing aid. Coming up. Hi guys, Cliff Olson, Doctor of Audiology and founder of Applied Hearing Solutions in Anthem, Arizona. And on this channel, I cover a bunch of hearing related information to help make you a better informed consumer. So if you're into that, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to click the bell to receive a notification every time I post a new video. For the past three years, Savantos, who owns Rexton and Signia hearing aid brands, also has been the manufacturer of the Kirkland Signature 7.0 and 8.0 hearing aids. But not anymore, because that baton has been passed to a company named Sonova, who will now be the manufacturer of the Kirkland Signature 9.0 hearing aids. Now, you may be familiar with the company Sonova already, because they manufacture some well-known brands such as Phonak, Unitron, and Hansaton. And based on what we know from the recent announcement, the core features of the 9.0 will be very similar to those that are found in the Phonak Aldeo Marble and the Unitron Moxie Jump. So let's go ahead and get into those features. First is the form factor. Like generations before, the 9.0 will be a receiver in the canal device with four different receiver power levels and a 312 disposable battery. This is the most common hearing aid style out there and is also the one that can fit the widest range of hearing losses. Second is the operating system. Similar to AutoSense 3.0 and SoundNav 3.0 like you'll find in Phonak devices and Unitron devices, the Signature 9.0 hearing aids will also be able to automatically classify what type of environment that you're in, so it can automatically adjust into the program settings that are best for that environment, as well as automatically classifying music and speech when streaming audio directly from a smart device. Third is the programmability. With Phonak inspired programming software, your hearing care professional will have up to 20 different frequency bands to adjust inside of the software, as well as a bunch of digital features that are likely very similar to those features that you can find inside of Phonak Odeo Marvel hearing aids. So these devices, the signature 9.0 devices, should have a high range of customizability as long as your hearing care professional is up to the task. And fourth is the Bluetooth capability. The Signature 9.0 hearing aids aren't going to be just made for iPhone. They're actually going to be made for basically any phone. So whether you have a flip phone, whether you have an iPhone, whether you have an Android phone, you're going to be able to stream audio directly into both of your ears from any of those devices. This includes music, podcasts, audiobooks, YouTube videos, whatever it is, you can stream that directly into both of your hearing aids. And when you're on the phone, you don't even need the phone in your hands to be able to talk to the other person because it takes the voice from your mouth into the hearing aid and sends it off to the other person. Aside from all the great features of the Kirkland Signature 9.0 hearing aids, in my opinion, these hearing aids have to be the most de-featured hearing aids that Costco has ever dispensed. While they aren't technically Phonak or Unitron hearing aids, they do lack some of the coolest features that Sonova has put inside of its flagship brands. For instance, the 9.0s are not rechargeable. Lithium rechargeability has become the standard inside of the hearing industry at this point. It has proven to be extremely reliable and extremely convenient, especially for individuals who have issues with finger dexterity, and these devices only come with a disposable size 312 battery. The new signature devices will also not have a telecoil. Now I know this is something that will not make the Hearing Loss Association of America happy because a telecoil is probably the single most underrated feature inside of a hearing aid and is something that can dramatically improve the way that you hear in a public venue and on the telephone. Like all hearing aids sold in Costco, they will not have any tinnitus features inside of them so they are not ideal for individuals who suffer from tinnitus and they will not have the ability to be remotely programmed. So if you're someone who has issues getting in to see your hearing care professional, they will not have the ability to remotely program you when you're in the comfort of your own home. And finally, the Kirkland Signature 9.0 hearing aids will not have integrated Roger receivers that you will find standard inside of the Phonak Odeo Marvel devices, so you'll not be able to directly connect to a Roger microphone, which can dramatically improve how well you hear in a background noise situation. Despite all the features that you give up in the Kirkland Signature 9.0 hearing aids, they are still a solid hearing aid option, and for only $1,500 for a pair, there is still a ton of value there. Just remember, it does not matter how awesome your hearing aids are or what features they have inside of them unless your hearing care professional has the ability to maximize their performance by following best practices. Now, if you don't know what best practices are, I highly recommend that you watch my video that I will link in the description. That's it for this video. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. If you like the video, please share it. And if you want to see other videos just like this one, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'll see you next time.